Hi everyone. Okay, we are going to talk about getting a little bit of definition on um, your face, kind of carving out those features you want to highlight and um, setting your makeup and adding a little bit of color to your face. And the perfect way to do that is with our blush trio palette, okay? This is completely customizable. I have a translucent powder, a bronzer, and a blush. We have so many different options you can choose from. Um, you could do all blushes, all bronzers. You could do all powders if you wanted to. Literally whatever you want, and then whenever you run out, you just pop out what you need and replace it. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you how to get a little um, look with this. I do highly recommend a powder, bronzer, and blush, kind of like the Neapolitan ice cream, because um, I'm gonna show you how to, how to get a great look with it. So we're gonna go in with our powder, and I'm gonna set my under eye, my kind of T-zone area, my eyelids, all that good stuff. I just have our Perfect Complexion Palette on, um, which is this right here. That is the only thing I have on my face, and I did use our brow pencil on my brows. So I'm just going to take the corner of this brush, the side of this brush actual, actually, and put a little bit on, and I am literally just going to press it in. Okay, this is gonna set my makeup, give it a nice photo finish. If you are oily, you can literally go all, all around your face. I just kind of hit these areas right here. Make sure to do my eyelids. Okay. Next, we're gonna go in with a bronzer. I have got a matte one in here, but we have shimmers, we have dark shades, like super contour shades. We have cool tone, warm tone. We can help you pick out your perfect bronzer. The one I have in here is a matte. So I'm gonna go in with a little, this is a Morphe brush. Just gonna go in there, kind of tap it off. And I am literally gonna carve out these cheekbone area right here, which I do not have but we're gonna fake it till we make it. Okay, so you just wanna kinda of take it. You don't have to use a lot of product and just kinda of work it back and forth. Okay, I go back in a little bit, tap it off, and I'm gonna work on minimizing this forehead of mine. So I'm just kinda of take it right in there and kind of create that shadow. Wherever the sun would naturally come down if you were standing on a tree, under a tree, like where that, that shadow would hit is where you want to kind of create that shadow. Remember, dark colors, contour, sink in, highlights bring out. So anywhere you put light, you want to highlight, obviously. And anywhere um, you put that dark is where you want to like minimize it. So I like to minimize this area. So I don't know if y'all can see the difference, but we just kind of create a shadow. And I build it up. I do not use a ton of product at once. It's easier to add, very hard to take away. And another tip is always start where you want the most color. Okay, so when you're doing blush, you're not gonna wanna go right here. With the contour, I start here and then I bring it down. I think this light's crazy. Let me raise it up a little bit. There we go. All right. Looks like it's dark. Take it down your neck, you can do your nose. Just kind of create that little contoured look. If you wanted to just go a bronzy effect, you could totally take a fluffy brush and just kind of hit all those high points of your face um, and just give you that bronze glow. But I did a little bit more of a contour. So now I'm gonna take my blush color and I am gonna go in this brush, this is another brush, but it's the same the same style. This is actually brush number one. Um, and I'm just gonna put a little bit in there, tap it off, and I'm just gonna place it 
right here and kind of create like Neapolitan. So you're like, um, your bronzer, your 